scientist undertook the study for one fishing season from October 2008 to May 2009. The Tall Boat Owners Association of Gujarat willingly came forward and offered three trawlers for the study. The study was designed to find out how much fish is lost through the use of legal 40 mm mesh. What is the actual worth of fish that would have escaped through the 40 mm mesh? The scientists fitted 20 mm mesh net outside the 40 mm mesh nets. All the small fishes that escaped the 40 mm net were retained in the 20 mm net. These nets were then supplied to the three fishing boats for trawling operations. Enumerators on board each fishing vessel recorded accurately the catch. Research fellows collected price information of the catch at the fishing harbor. The study revealed that the quantity of young and low value fish that escaped from the 40 mm net was less than 20% in multi day trawling. Scientists then calculated the value of the escaped fish. They found that on an average it was less than rupees 25 per haul. This is a very negligible amount. Compared to the average revenue per haul of rupees 1800. Fishermen can also increase the price per kilogram of their catch. For example, one kilogram of baby squid would fetch only rupees twenty. While one kilogram of grown squid will fetch rupees sixty, a three times increase in price in just two to three months. Scientists demonstrated a very important fact to the fishermen of Gujarat. By following the legal mesh size and good practice of fishing, they can increase the income by three times. It is legally correct and financially beneficial to follow responsible and good fishing practices. is about 4 cm mesh size and even uh, about 10 to 20 kilo fishes passes away and we are fetching about uh, 2 rupees or 3 rupees a kilo of trash fish so if even 10 kilo passes away then we are losing about 50 rupees a haul so there is no much big difference for that but this small fish which is passing away will become uh, in future the brooders or some like some kind of we, we can even catch so it will be helpful to fish them ultimately नाकणवाड़ा जो मजू है तम अमरा मछीमारी मच्छी आ जाने अमार विनाशता कारक जार है अमरा भविष्य अंदर जो अमरी पेढ़ी से अमरा बच्चा भूखे न मरे ने दरिया अंदर थी जो आयोजन कार थे तो अमरा बे छोरा सूकी रही अमे इच्छी अमरे जे नुकसानी थोड़ी ओछी है पर अमने भविष्य अमने बहु ध्यान है कि भाई भविष्य में अत्यार अमार पचास रुपया नुकसान थे तो भविष्य में अमार पांच हजार रुपया जो अमरी पेढ़ी ने फरक पड़े ये अमे मानिएट्स लुक एट दिस फिशर मैन एक्सपीरियंस आफ्टर एडोप्टिंग द फोर्टी एम एम मैश आर फोर फादर्स यूज टू कैच ओली वट दे नीड इट but we with modern equipment and better facilities plunder our seas as a result we are getting less catch every year even if we put more effort following these sustainable and legal methods will increase the acceptance and ensure 
better price for our products in the international market. Look at the overall result. We ensure consistent income, not only for today, but also for our future generations as well. I use only 40 millimeter mesh. And look at my catch. I am happy. I got good value for the work I did. And I left enough for my children too. This project has very clearly shown that losses due to use of 40 mm square mesh is negligible. By adopting the legal mesh size, our trawl fisheries can become a sustainable practice. This in turn would help them to remain competitive in the future fisheries export scenario where buyers are increasingly conscious of the sustainability and green certification of the fish that they are buying.